What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt Deville with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Timothy the Desert Storm Bradley. Timothy Bradley had this to say about Keith One Time Thurman. He says Keith Thurman needs to get his mind right. Wow. And he, he explains, he says, One Time is getting older now, and he's fighting better opposition. Thurman's injuries, lousy eating habits, and lack of focus on boxing are starting to catch up with him. He also says that um, what he saw the night he lost, and Timothy Bradley was surprised that everyone was shocked about Thurman's first loss, or that he lost in general. And he said this, he said, I just saw it hungry or Pacquiao. He wanted it, said Bradley. He was a dog. I picked Thurman to win the fight. Thurman was supposed to win that fight. This is a 40 year old Pacquiao now. This is not a prime season Pacquiao. You saw in the second half of the fight what Pacquiao did. He then pulled back a little bit with conditioning, you know? With mouth wide open, Thurman did a great job of going down to the body of Pacquiao, but it wasn't consistent, said Bradley. <clears throat> he says, do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Pulling back each time, getting hit with those body shots, said Bradley. He got hit with a jab. Come on, a jab, bro, come on now. And that whole gambling thing, Bro, you've got to have your mind right, seriously. Thurman shouldn't have lost that fight. He's bigger, he's a stronger guy, and he's the longer guy. He can box, and he has good legs, said Bradley. Wow. Look, um, Bradley goes off on Keith Thurman. And I can agree, you know, to a certain extent, especially what he said about lack of focus, the injuries, the bad eating habits. You know, I recall Keith Thurman having an interview and he was like 180 pounds. Dude, you're like damn near 40 pounds overweight. And and this is between fights. The injuries, you know, that's, that's something that a lot of people go through, but I think that deals with, uh, with conditioning also. Um, and the lack of focus, yes, he got married, yes, he's in love, but then before he got married, he was lacking, he was slacking, he was ducking, he wasn't that same Keith Thurman. So lack of focus, I remember the Keith Thurman, you better not duck me thun, that Keith Thurman was the guy that wanted to fight everybody. Did it, did it make him bitter that he didn't get Mayweather? I think so a little bit, but then, and then everyone pushed him, or should I say Mayweather, pushed uh Errol Spence in his face as an you know as opposition and he didn't want to hear that. But then I think he did get rather complacent when he did take that WBC off Danny Garcia. So he fought Sean Porter, then Danny Garcia, and then Keith Thurman I think lost focus because I don't think that it was something that I don't think it was anything else he wanted to do in the sport. He had the money, he got the belts he didn't get to fight Mayweather, but he did get to fight with Pacquiao, and Pacquiao beat him. But see, I think Keith Thurman underestimated Pacquiao, the speed, and the things that Pacquiao could still do. You know what I mean? It's like taking it easier on someone that you know you have a full advantage over. He's bigger, he's taller, he's longer, right? But then you're younger, <laughs> but then it's like you underestimate that that older guy and that's what happened he was put down in the first round and everybody went ballistic because they're looking at a 40 year old Pacquiao doing something that he didn't supposed to do and as far as Timothy Bradley he's right on that regards but I think uh, a little pride is hurting Timothy Bradley it's some truth intertwined in it but I think because he picked uh, Keith Thurman to win that doesn't mean he was going to win <laughs> You know, and I get what Timothy Bradley was saying, like he should have won, you know, based on the lack of focus or whatever. But I think, I think Keith Thurman just got caught off guard. He didn't think that uh, uh, Manny Pacquiao was going to spring like he did off those big calves, you know, and catch him with that right hook, slapping him to the ground.
He didn't think that, you know. But then again, to be fair, Keith Thurman ain't never been in there with no one like that. And again, when you talk smack about a person that says, you know, like Keith Thurman, Manny Pacquiao ain't got a goddamn thing, right? And he was ranting and stuff and saying, you know, that Pacquiao don't have what it takes to beat him. Well, you, you better be ready and you better be prepared for whatever. And you better be ready to back it up. Because if you don't, you're going to look foolish because that's exactly what happened. This older Pacquiao, even though Pacquiao in the later half, in the, in the second half of that fight did get tired, he was gasping, right? His mouth was open. He was getting caught with certain things, but, you know, Keith Thurman did rally and it was a split decision loss. It wasn't a bad loss, but you got to remember something about Keith Thurman. He's been in tough split decisions before. Well, it just went in his favor this time. It did not because of the knockdown. Okay. So, um, now I have to be fair. Timothy Bradley got with Teddy Atlas. Teddy Atlas was moving Timothy Bradley along. Tim, Tim is a gym rat anyway. So he has no problem with discipline, you know, desert storm. I think, you know, he's kind of military based in mind. So that 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 uh, camaraderie with Teddy Atlas went along real well together, right? But then who did he lose by? Who was he knocked down by for the first time in in in, in um in that saga? Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao put this boy down with the tutelage of uh, Teddy Atlas. So ask yourself this question, people: Was that Manny Pacquiao in his prime? No. But he was just a good fighter. And I think that's what Timothy Bradley's failed to understand. And a lot of guys, like he said himself, his B game or C plus game is better than a lot of guys' A game. You know what I mean? And so if, if Keith Thurman was at, at his A game, okay, that matches his C plus game because it was a split decision loss. You know? But, uh, but yeah, I will say that. So Timothy Bradley, you know, might have expected uh, Keith Thurman to lose, but he lost to... Fanny Pacquiao, arguably every fight. <laughs> of course, he got the first win or whatever, but, you know, a lot of people know you didn't win that fight, right? But anyway, that's my take on Timothy Bradley. You guys tell me what you think about his comments in regards to Keith Thurman and Manny Pacquiao. Of course, please subscribe, and you guys been counterpunched. Peace.